Hello hi and welcome back to Makeup Mistress. Well today I'll be showing you this look which you can easily wear uh, for this Eid and even if you want to go to any party uh, as a guest so you can definitely wear this and on any of your special occasions as well. So if you want to see how I created this look please have a look. <laughs> So as usual, I'm doing my eyebrows, but then I'm just concealing the outer side and not filling in the brows right now and applying the concealer on my eyelid just to give a nice base for my eyeshadow and I'm today using the Kylie Royal Blue palette and using this uh, maroonish peachy shade as a crease color and then I'll be using the Jeffree Star palette and using this maroon shade uh, to give a little definition to the uh, socket and blend it really nicely then using the Kylie palette again and using this metallic green shade and just with the help of my fingers I'm applying it on just the uh, eyeballs and the inner corners not on the outer side and now I'm filling my eyebrows with the brow powder from makeup revolution and I'm in the shade dark brown so my brows are actually uh, black so I'm using the dark brown and then winging my eyeliner so just this way you have to make a line and just see whether both are equal or not and then you have to you know uh, thicken it up as your need as per your wish and need and whatever so just the way a brush is absolutely needed and a lot of hard work patience and you know give time to it now using the colors on my lower lash line before I apply any kajal so I'll use the gel eyeliner from L'Oreal to uh, my lower lash line and then using the orange color corrector from Kerylon and I'm correcting my under eye whether although I, I don't have that under eye dark circle thingy but then still I thought of using it just to show you guys so uh, you know this helps in uh, hiding all the darkness and all the spots from the skin so I have little spots here and there uh, and little pigmentation issues here and there so I'm just uh, blending it with my fingers and this is a big 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 pimple out there oh my god and then you know blending with my fingers only I'm just blending 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 so that no place is left and then using a brush I'm just blending all together and the concealer also which I used uh, to shape my brows and then using a little loose powder to set the orange color corrector otherwise it is gonna blend with my foundation and you know it will be a mess <laughs> I look all orangish so I'm just blending it and then setting it with uh, some loose powder from Kralin only and I'm using the uh, LA colors uh, foundation I'm in the shade uh, medium beige and just bl and blending it properly and just buffing it actually and uh, yes so into my skin so that you know it blends really smoothly yes with the help of a fluffy brush and now I'll be contouring with uh, with the wheel uh, color corrector from Kralon in the shade dark and I'm just contouring my face uh, cream color uh, contouring so because uh, you know today I wanted to and uh, this way I can give my face a little uh, dimension and cut the fat from my face <laughs> and uh, blend them all nicely with the brush and I'll be uh, using some powder contour as well this palette is from Dubai and I have used this in my previous videos as well so you can use any uh, contour powder bronzing powder anything you want 
and then just you know this will help my contour to set in place and then using some highlighting shade from Kralon and on my under eye bridge of my nose and forehead and chin area because you know I'm not highlighting it that much but then using a little bit of product you can see and this is just a shade lighter than my skin tone just to give a little you know highlight and light to pass my face and uh, yes blending it all together and then using again some loose powder to set the concealer uh, the highlighted concealer under my eye and bridge of my nose and wherever I applied it and now again I'm using the mm, the colors that I used on my eyes and just to give a little depth to my eyes you know the little wine shades under my eye and then using this golden uh, color eyeshadow uh, from Jeffree Star palette uh, just to highlight the inner corners and then using some purplish color from the same eyeshadow palette uh, using it as a highlighter I'm not highlighting my face that much like I always tend to highlight my face a lot 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 yes using this purple shade and but then today I'm using a little bit of it so you can use any any color that you have in your eyeshadow palette now using some blush blush from the Shivana palette and uh, yes today I'm in a mood to blush blush <laughs> okay this is a liquid eyeliner from HR and this is a local um, you know store uh, one so I got it from local store and I absolutely love this this is in the shade olive green and wearing Nykaa's Mishti the famous shade and I absolutely love this shade the time for some fake lashes which I really don't wear much but then today I'm wearing I don't know why <laughs> so yes I'm so happy with the lashes and some jewelry I'll just get ready and yes this is the final look I hope you all loved the way I got ready and uh, you know I have done this middle parting you want you can uh, you know do any hairstyle you want but then I prefer uh, leaving my hair all open and yes this is such a subtle but gorgeous kind of a look the Mangtika is from Hyderabad the nose pin is from uh, Senosia's closet and the earring is from Kolkata's Goyanar Bak Show. You can get them on Instagram all and yes, see you super soon with my next video and do subscribe, stay subscribed. I'll see you super soon. Bye.